Okay, sa video na ito, hahanapin natin yung value ng R1 which is yung reaction towards up at yung R2 reaction towards up din. So, yung given dito, 400 pound acting downward, yung R2 natin has a distance of 4 feet from 400 pound. Yung R2 natin ha, may distance na 2 feet from the corner of 100 pound uh, um, similar or equal distributed force. And R1 natin has a distance of 6 feet from 300 pound. So, anong gagawin natin para ma-identify yung value ng R1 at R2? So, since meron tayong dalawang anodes, so, simply mag-set tayo ng moments sa isang anode. So, for example, dito tayo mag-set ng moments sa R sub 1. So, magiging equation nito, moments of R sub 1 is equals to 0. So, assuming na yung uh, clockwise or counterclockwise is positive so moment of r sub 1 is equals to itong 300 has a distance of 6 feet perpendicular from r sub 1 so therefore uh, 300 times 6 so it is also um, rotating counterclockwise into r sub 1 so therefore positive sign next is minus. So, since meron tayong uh, multiple force acting on this uh, object, so yung gagawin natin is to set this multiple force into single force. So, paano natin set ito into single force? So, simply lang. So, itong total na force ng multiple force, which is 100, multiply to distance. So, from this point to this point. So, meron tayong 6 plus 8 is 14. So, itong uh, distributed force ay eh, merong value na 1,400 pound. So, it is uh, acting downward kasi dito siya nag, na naglay sa uh, object na composed ng mga force. So, therefore, 1,400 multiply 2. So, alam natin na ito is 1,400 pound. So, paano natin malalaman? yung distance niya. So, alam natin na 1,400 pound na ito. Pero hindi natin alam kung saan part dito yung 1,400 pound. So, meaning, kapag uh, equal distribution ng force, so, hindi siya triangle, yung distance niya is sa center. So, ito. Yung 1,400 pound. So, yung distance niya is simply 6 plus 8 divided 2. So, 6 plus 8 divided 2 is 7. So, ito, so, since na ito, yung distance na lang nyo dito is 1. 1. At saka dito matitira is 7. So, ano yung distance ng 1,400 with respect to R sub 1? So, it is 1. Next. Um, bakit minus? Kasi it is rotating clockwise. So, next is R sub 2. So, yung arrow niya is going upward. So, yung um, rotation niya is counterclockwise. So, positive. R sub 2. So, ito yung ano natin. Multiply sa distance, which is 2 plus 8. So, 10. And lastly, 400 pound. So, it is rotating clockwise. So, negative 400 times 8 plus 2 plus 4 is 14 equals 0. So, itong uh, R sub 2 is masasolve na natin. So, simplify natin ito. So, 1,800 minus 1,400 plus 10 R sub 2 minus 5,600 equals 0. So, itong mga numbers, i-add natin um, algebraic or uh, based on their sign. So, 1,800 minus 1,400 is 400 plus 10 R2 minus 5, 6 equals 0. So next, 400 minus 5,600 is 5,200 negative equals 10 R2 or positive na. Kasi itong 10 is dito na. Tapos yung negative na value, nilipat natin sa kabila. So magiging positive. So divide natin by 10 at yung R sub 2 natin has a value of 
520 pound so we took our step to is 520 pound so ito siya so hindi siya negative therefore it is going upward so tama yung approach natin so next is Solving for moments or sub 2. So, ito kanina yung along natin or yung in-eliminate. Therefore, ito naman yung eliminate natin para may identify natin yung value ng r sub 1. So, assuming na din na yung counterclockwise is positive. So, moments of r sub 2 equals itong 300 multiply to 6 plus 8 plus 2 is 16 plus yung 1 for natin same lang din yung direction therefore positive at yung distance nya is hindi 8 ha kundi 7 kasi yung uh, arrow nya is dito sa middle so it is 7 at 7 so 7 plus 2 is 9 so 1400 times 9 so ito 400 so it is rotating clockwise so minus 400 times distance nya to r2 is 4 and lastly yung ano natin na r sub 1 so r sub 1 so ito yung arrow nya dito so it is rotating clockwise meaning negative yung distance nya is 8 plus 2 is 10 so equals 0. So, pwede na natin to simplify. So, 300 times 16 is 4,800 plus 1, 4 times 9, 1,600 minus 1,600 uh, imbu na lang natin ito sa kabila para maging 10 or 1 positive. So, simplify natin using your calculator. So, this equal to 15 800 equals 10 R1. So, divide natin by 10. At yung R sub 1 natin is, cancel lang yung 0, 1580. So, uh, so, para masolve kung tama yung solution natin, mag, magsiset tayo ng uh, equilibrium. So, dito na lang natin ilagay sa baba na yung summation of f of y natin equals 0. So, yung going up is positive. So, r sub 1 natin, which is 1580 plus r sub 2, which is 520 minus 400 minus 1400 minus 300 equals 0. So, ito, 2, 1. Itong negative sign add natin is also 1. So, ito, 0 equals 0. Therefore, yung value ng R, at R sub 1 at R sub 2 natin ay tama.